we come to um, support and to hear uh, from a person who has served you well in the community of Long Branch. We pray now that you would um, be a fence around him as he takes on a courageous journey. Um, and we pray that um, those that uh, are in this room have come um, with ears to listen, uh, a mind to receive uh, what he has to say on tonight. I'd like to talk a little bit about my husband's desires. Um, he is a lifelong resident of Long Branch and this is something that we have been looking forward to um, for years. He's always working and committed to the residents here in Long Branch. His endeavors to make certain that the quality of life here in Long Branch remains as well as it always is. And so our community has always been his first love. Um, anyone that knows Bill knows that he has a passion for just helping others. And that is a true passion of his. And I'm so glad to see so many of you out here. My son, I would like to personally thank all of you who came out this afternoon to uh, honor my son or to encourage him in this walk. This is not a Christian walk, I understand that, but this is a tough walk. Everybody that's in there for you, I hope in next year, the same time, they will still be for it. And that many more are, as Jermaine said, this is his birthday. And I, above everybody, know how my child was. But if anybody had ever told me that Billy Daniel would have ran for the Board of Education, for the NAACP all these years, and now for the city council. I would not have believed it. <laughs> he was the quietest child that I had. Uh, if you could have said another one of my kids, I'd have believed it, but not Billy, <laughs> because Billy was very quiet, very to himself. Uh, but I still thank God that he brought me a long ways. I thank God for blessing me that I stayed here 80 years to see this day. I hope that I would I hope that I will be still standing next year when the election is over to see my son walk in and get his, what, the, the gal, whatever they do, <laughs> swearing in. I've never been to one, but I know you have to be sworn in. But I say thank y'all for coming. And just don't forget, when you're out amongst the friends, you got a long time to talk. Instead of talking about each other, we're going to talk about Billy. Right. Uh, you for coming out tonight. This is uh, obviously a big, big night. And as you can hear, uh, I've already checked with both of the bosses in the Daniel household, my mother and my wife. Um, so they are all, all in, in support of me, giving up more time um, to donate to the city of Long Ridge. I would like to acknowledge before I forget my team. And when I say my team, the, the, those who got us here today, who helped organize this. We've been meeting for a couple months now. And uh, I just want to say thank you to them. Uh, that would be Reverend Devereaux, Dave A. Brown, Benita Brown, Star Johnson, Mr. and Ms. Jumps, Tierra Brown. So also say thank you, number one, to our elected officials, Mayor Snyder, Councilman Pallone, Reverend Gibson, our elected official, but certainly spiritual leader in our community. Mr. Grant, Board of Education, uh, the Worshipful Master, Milton Morris, I have to hesitate when I say that because he's been a long time friend, so Milton, thank you for being here as well. And uh, we have a couple of people from law enforcement, uh, former prosecutor's office, Lou Jordan, and uh, Lieutenant Gene Stewart. So thank all of you for, for coming out if you will. So we're looking for volunteers for those who may want to have a few so we can get some personal, like we're doing today, but even smaller groups, so we can have some personal time and get some ideas. I was speaking to some of the young people in the back today uh, on what some of their concerns are. And their concerns are, might be a little bit different than what some of the uh, older uh, folk ideas are and needs are, but it all come together to make longer and better place. So um, that's, uh, that's pretty much it. I do, and I'm glad that you're all here. I really, really am touched to have you all here today in support of uh, what we're trying to do, which is to make Long Beach even better than it already is.